NBC10 is shining a light on women making history now. Today we're introducing you to the first woman hired as president of an NHL team not part of an ownership group. Valerie Camillo has been making history with the Flyers in the middle of a pandemic. NBC10's Lucy Bustamante brings us her story. Hard work, grit, determination. It was January of 2019 when Valerie Camillo got the news that her dream had come true. She is the first woman hired as president of a National Hockey League team who isn't part of an ownership group. I consider it a great honor and also a great responsibility. And while she had just shattered a glass ceiling, Camillo had to focus on a team shattered by a cancer diagnosis. Oscar Lindblom's comeback from cancer was a big deal for the Flyers. When he returned to the ice, we didn't have the opportunity to recognize him with fans because we were dealing with the, uh, uh, the situation of the pandemic. Camillo also had to pivot from selling tickets to a fan base to giving them the support they needed to get through the pandemic. She directed the launch of the Flyers' hometown assist program and while hiring more and more women to join her team. About a third of our employees are female, but 50% of our senior executive team is female, which quite frankly, I think is more important because the culture of an organization uh, is set at the top and where the power resides. She credits her own female mentor. I was very blessed in my career um, when I was first coming up to have a, a female executive mentor and boss. And I worked for her for almost a decade and she really cared about my career as much as she cared about her own. And that's a very difficult thing to find. Camillo now tells other young women in the field, get an MBA. No, microaggressions will happen, but focus on finding the allies. Every job that I was ever offered in sports and entertainment, and I've been offered some really phenomenal jobs along my career, came to me through a man. A man made me that offer. And when you're at the top, celebrate other women, like the female staffers who developed none other than Gritty. And focus on the fans, know who they are. More than half of our ticket buyers are women. And so, you know, the best way to understand your customers is to reflect your customer. And to focus once again on the ice. When you think about the purpose of a sports team, it's to build community, it's to bring people together. And finally, Focus on how much this community has had to overcome just to pick up right where we left off. The first game back with fans just the other week, we recognized Oscar, and that was an incredibly special moment for the franchise, for him, and for our fan base to be able to welcome him back from such a phenomenal accomplishment. Lucy Bustamante, NBC 10 News.